wait here. Almost there. Ready? Go! <laughs> In the words of Victor Sullivan, I'll be go to hell. Over here. Wow. Victor Sullivan. Welcome to a bar. Another dead end.
incredible. This is how the city could thrive all the way out here. The whole place must be fed by an underground spring. It's clean. It's amazing. It's still running after all these years. That's a hell of a thing. What? No. <clears throat> no. Please. Sully.
Helmet! Come back here, you son of a bitch! You're dead! You hear me? You're dead! You come back here, you... since I was a kid. What's going on with me? Oh shit. Oh no. Oh no! This can't be happening. No. Stay away, please. Oh, God. He's moving. I gotta get out. I gotta get out of here. No, no, no. No. I can't do this. What is this? What's happening? Killed Sully! I'll kill you! You killed Sully!
Demons. Fire demons. Demons. Water smoke is fire. Can't be real. Sully! No. No, it can't be real. It can't be real.
to play, assholes. It's over, Drake. You've got no place to run. Here we go again. What are you, a coward? <laughs> Hit the dirt!
you kid? Oh, thank God. You all right? Man, I had a hell of a time. What's the matter with you? How do I know you're real? Ow! That real enough for you? <sighs> Don't ever point a gun at me again. <sighs> I saw them shoot you. Right after the eclipse. What? What eclipse? Look, kid, you went nuts right after you drank from that fountain. It's the water. That's what destroyed the city. Not the wrath of God. The whole water supply is tainted with some sort of hallucinogenic agent. Must have drove everyone mad. That's what Marlowe and Talbot are after. Oh, man, yeah. Remember, Cutter said... They controlled their enemies through fear. <laughs> this would do it. In spades. But, wait, it doesn't make any sense. How do they think they're getting the water out of here? No, no, it's not the water. It's what's in the water. Come again? All right, listen, just bear with me for a sec. Salim told me that Aram was cursed when Solomon imprisoned the evil spirits of the jinn inside a vessel of brass and then cast it into the depths of the city. A genie in a bottle. I know, it sounds pretty crazy. So you reckon that's why Elizabeth and Dee sent Francis Drake out here in the first place? Yeah. It wasn't treasure they were after. It was power. Only once Drake realized what he'd been sent for, he abandoned the mission. He lied to the Queen, told her he didn't find anything, and then hid all traces of his voyage rewrote history. Well, who will we to argue with Sir Francis? When you say we head down there and end this thing, once and for all. <laughs> <laughs>